Hi guys, welcome to your um, love reading for Leo. This is going to be for your October 2024. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. We are going to take a look and see um, the person that you're dealing with, thinking of, separated from, or see what this person has on their mind when it comes to you, okay? Um, so apply this to your own unique situation, switch the roles if you want. You can apply this to new love, current love, or an ex. Um, like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in um, following me on TikTok, I already said that. If you guys are interested in... Um, uh, booking a personal reading with me. The link for that is also in the description box below. All right, Leo, let's get started here. Talk about Leo, the person that Leo is dealing with, thinking of, separated from. What is on the mind of this person that Leo is dealing with, thinking of, separated from? Like I said, you could apply this to new love, current love, or an ex. Two of Pentacles here. Seems like this person doesn't really know what they want here. You know, very interesting. Seems like this person is juggling here, okay? But the Sun card, and you know, it could also be indication that this person is seeing you as their happiness or that this person is doing everything that they can to sort of like keep this going here, okay? Interesting. Eight of Swords here. Five of Pentacles, okay? This person's incredibly insecure here. Queen, uh, King of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. So energies we have here so far, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, the Sun and the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Whoever this is, uh, okay, I feel like this is a new person that's coming into your life here, where I do feel like this person definitely has a huge crush on you. I feel like this person has feelings here for you, but I feel like this person's scared to come forward here because I feel like this person fears rejection here. So, you know, I do feel like whoever this is, eventually this person will come up or come forward to tell you the truth. They might not be coming in so quickly here, but I do feel like this person is going to take some time to come forward here to tell you how they feel. Uh, you know, I do feel like whoever this is, this person has strong feelings here for you. Uh, very interesting here. Yeah, with the blood... You know, whoever this is, I feel like this person is definitely sending you some mixed signals here, okay? But I do feel like truly to the core of this person, this person has feelings here for you. All right, the Two of Pentacles here. And we have the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy. The Sun. And the Four of Cups. Ah, I, I feel like this person really fears rejection here. Yeah, this person fears being let down here. So I feel like this person is just not saying how they feel at this time. But I feel like this person is trying to make plans here. This person is trying to think of a way to come forward to tell you how they feel. Okay, we have the Five of Pentacles here. And the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. We also have the King of Swords here. And also the Two of Cups. Yeah, whoever this is, I feel like this person has love on their mind here when it comes to you. This person's falling in love with you here, but this person's slow to come forward to tell you here. I feel like you're just Nine of Pentacles here. Virgo energy, pre-Empress energy here, uh, Leo. What else does Leo need to know? Look out for work on for October 2024. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for... Leo. Three of Swords. Okay. Judgment. Side of Chariot's Energy. I mean, this could apply to also an X here, too. Yeah. Let's see. With a Page of Wands here, Aries, Leo, Side of Chariot's Energy. The Magician, Gemini Virgo. Five of Wands. And the Knight of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. 
it seems like whoever this is, you know, this could also apply to a past person where someone here could be coming back around to reconcile here with you. Someone here who broke your heart. Someone here who was not act, being, acting serious. Someone here was that was manipulative here. They could be coming back around to apologize. Now, if this is a new person here, someone here could be coming to a realization or that they're awakening to the fact that you are the one for them and they feel like you could heal their pain or heal their hurt or their traumas here, okay? Just make sure, it, you know, if this person sees an opportunity for healing here, you know, make sure you're not doing the healing for this person here. You know, make sure this person's not putting it all on you, you know, just because you're around, you know, all their pain, all their hurt will go away and this person just puts it on you. This person has to take responsibility for their own healing here. The Three of Swords, we have the Three of Wands judgment in the nine of wands here seems like there was some sort of pain and some, some sort of hurts that some of you might have experienced here um but you know what 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 this comes down to is that this person has love on the mind you know i feel like this person is just in love with you here okay the uh page of swords and like i said i feel like this person is trying to make plans to come around towards you and tell you how they feel with the page of wands here in the hermit virgo energy the magician and also we have the four of pentacles here with the five of wands and also the lovers here gemini energy and also the knight of swords here and the two of swords hmm. This is really interesting. We are the two of swords. I mean, this could be an indication that you might be blocking this person's communication here or that this person's in complete denial about how they feel about you. And they feel like this person's trying to turn away from this and run away from this here. You know, at the night, end of the day, you know, this person's in love with you. You know, the heart wants what it wants, right? So, you know, this person can't keep running from how they feel. You know, when they do that, they're not really honoring themselves for who they are or how they're feeling here, you know? So, yeah, I kind of like tough luck for this individual or tough shit for this individual here. This person's in love with you, but, uh, you know, uh, this person can't run from it here. I mean, this person sees you in such high regard here, Leo. With the Empress here, Libra Taurus, we also had pre-Empress energy, uh, if you remember. Uh, you know, this person does see growth and expansion here with you. This person finds you very attractive here. You know, this person sees you as somebody here that they feel like they could build a life here with. With the Seven of Swords, th this could also be an indication that, you know, because of this, the way that this person's behaving here, because of the experience that you have experienced in the past here, you could be in this energy of protecting yourself here. Or that this person has a, has a pattern of self-sabotage here, okay? Yeah, Knight of Wands here, Aries, Little Sagittarius energy. It seems like this person's definitely not showing any sort of seriousness surrounding this here. You know, any sort of seriousness or any sort of commitment here that this person is thinking about, it actually scares this individual here. Yeah, some no seems like this person's resisting how they feel about you. We have the King to Queen of Swords, but obviously, like I said, I mean, the heart want it, wants what it wants, right? It can't push that away forever. Um, you got to honor, honor yourself here. Whoever is, you know, feeling resistance towards it uh, or towards the situation here. So, um, Leo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.